for me. It's a pleasure to be here, an honor to be here. Thank you to the Cape Coral Civic Association for giving us the opportunity to speak tonight. Uh, folks, I'm not going to bore you with everything, all my credentials. You've uh, probably already know about that. I would ask if you would, please, before you leave, please try to pick up one of our campaign uh, postcards and one of our endorsement packets. They'll explain a whole lot. What I really want to talk to you about is the lack of representation on the Lee County bench for Cape Coral residents. There are no Cape Coral residents on the Lee County bench. I think that needs to change. I'm a 21 and a half year resident of Cape Coral. My children, although they were born in Fort Myers hospitals, they were raised here in Cape Coral. I coached softball and soccer here in Cape Coral. I've been a member of the Chamber of Commerce. I'm the law and order chair where I take juniors from high school and try to teach them and take them over to the courthouse, teach them about the legal process. I'm also part of something called Justice Teaching where I go in and basically uh, partnered up with Cape Coral High School and their teacher, and I teach kids, and I go out to speak to school. So why do, why do I bother so much with kids? Because they're our future. Because they need to know the importance of the Constitution. I believe in the Constitution, ladies and gentlemen. I believe it must be preserved, protected, defended. It must be applied as written. I believe, ladies and gentlemen, that good people have surrounded me in this campaign, not because I have a famous name. I don't have a famous name. But because I have the credentials to back up what I'm hoping to do, and that's bring and render justice in, in an excellent fashion on the county bench. I believe that uh, if you look at my credentials and, uh, and you read thoroughly through all the letters of support that we've gotten, you'll get a good glimpse of who I am. The bottom line is I, I want to do justice. I want to do justice in our children. They belong to all of us. I don't believe that anybody is entitled to this position merely by their name or their background. My opponent, he's a good guy. I'm not going to tell you he's a bad guy. He's a good guy. He's got a famous name. He's got Goliath of a name. That's okay, because I've got Goliath of experience, and I've got a lot of credentials to back me what I'm going to do in the courtroom. And the bottom line is, my hope is that when all is said and done, that you not pick someone just based on name. I know that you won't. This is a different type of crowd. This is a crowd that really studies candidates. This is an intelligent voter crowd, and I applaud you for that. All I ask is for a fair shake, and I believe that if you look at everything that I've done, you'll know that I'm going to do the right thing. It doesn't matter whether you're rich or you're poor, what po political affiliation you are. When I'm on the bench, I will treat you with dignity and respect. I will give you your day in court. I will make sure you've had a fair opportunity to present your case, and I will always come down on the law, because that's what you need and expect from your county judges, that they apply the law. For 22 years, ladies and gentlemen, 22 years I've been in the courtroom. Every week, 22 years, and that's because I love the corporate, and I want to continue to stay in the corporate. And so I hope that I can gain your confidence. If you have any questions on my website, or my table's over here tonight. If you have any questions on my website, there's a contact us page, and you can ask me questions. I'll do my best to answer them. Again, my name is Miguel Fernandez, 21 and a half year resident of Cape Coral, and we need Cape Coral rep representation on the Lee County bench. Thank you.